We told you all of this to help you understand the importance of getting the vaccine into arms. The state is hoping to get more shipments of the vaccine and the sooner the better. Here's our John Sheeran. Here's the cruel irony. The coronavirus vaccines from the federal government that can prevent infection are still only trickling into Georgia. At the very time the pandemic is, by many measures, at its worst in Georgia. And at the very time the new, more contagious variant of the virus is multiplying here. This variant, this virus does spread easily. It is even easier to acquire COVID now going out in public spaces than before because with this variant it's more easily spread. Georgia Public Health Commissioner Dr. Dr. Kathleen Toomey says the vaccines do work against the more contagious variant, but so far the state cannot get enough vaccines for everyone. This is not the time to grow complacent. We will still have far more demand than we have supply. Georgia Governor Brian Kemp says that beginning next week, Georgia will have, in effect, a 50% increase in doses available for everyone in Category 1A+. But that will still amount to only 120,000 doses for the week, a fraction of what's needed for a total of some 2 million Georgians who are in that category. The state is planning for mass vaccination sites, and yet... Are we going to get enough supply from the federal government to be able to even use an option like that because it does us no good to set that up and have people standing there if we do not have shots to give. As it is, the state is now working with providers to make sure that each person who is able to get the first dose does get an appointment for the second dose. John Sherrick reporting for us tonight, folks. We know how